Hey, Grant Cardone here. Uh, you guys at same day, guys and gals. You guys, at, I say guys all the time. Uh, you probably know who I am already. If not, I apologize to you. You're going to be getting to know me. I want to thank Charles, Charles for setting this up, hooking this up. And to all of you that are committed to your business, your career as entrepreneurs, as parents, as spouses, as community leaders uh, and entrepreneurs at Same Day Insurance, uh, first of all, I apologize for not being able to be there in a live video conference. I, I was booked on the same day that we were flying out to Italy and it was impossible for me to be Saturday where you will be Saturday because of the time change. So I apologize about that, but I wanted to make this short video uh, to set up one that Jared, my vice president of sales, is going to be working with you today. And number two, most importantly, I wanted to introduce myself and tell you what my mission is and how I can help you and your families and your business. Um, look, I, I, I'm a salesperson. I'm an expert salesperson, and I have committed the last 32 years to learning everything I could about sales, follow-up, prospecting, keeping a full pipeline, and how to stay stay sold on my proposition. And that's really what I want to talk to you about today is how do you stay sold with so many things that you have going on in your life with, you know, a marriage, kids probably, economic issues, the government doing crazy stuff, uh, the news. I got news going off in the background here. These people, these people in the background, they freaking crazy, man. CNN, CNBC, MSNBC. Uh, I mean, they're nuts, you know. I turned it on just to see what was happening in Nepal, and, and I'm like, okay, but I had to listen to everything else uh, before that. So I have some friends actually going to Nepal to help there, and I was interested in what happened this morning because I know they're on their way over there. So look, the career that you're in requires, basically you have a couple of choices. Do what most people do, it's nothing. The average salespeople have average incomes, sell average amounts of product, have the same average excuses every day. Uh, you, you might know this if you've been following me, 76% of Americans live paycheck to paycheck. That's what average gets you. Then there's a sliver, there's a sliver uh, of professional salespeople that are freaking, I mean, they're, they're, they're not born, they're made. They're made. You were born a baby. I was born a baby. I was made a salesperson. I committed. When I committed to my career, and Charles, Charles is giving you the material. He's giving you a multi-million dollar website with, uh, I don't know, 14 or 1,500 different videos on every topic from follow-up with a phone, follow-up with texting, follow-up with email, follow-up in person, how to set an appointment, how to fill a calendar up, how to take an incoming call, how to handle customer service, how to handle personality types, how to close, negotiate, how to make a greeting, how to build rapport, how to get on common ground with a customer, how to set up a deal, how to write a deal, how to make more deals, how to close more deals. I'm telling you, everything with the internet, social media, you name it, anything to do with marketing, branding, promoting you, your company, your brand, putting you in a position to be powerful with a customer, to give you confidence so that you can operate with the twins. The twins of confidence are speed and power. When you can move with speed, it means you have certainty. And then you have power in a deal. You have power and credibility and people won't push you around and they won't stall you and they won't put it off. So Jared, I'm gonna turn this over to Jared First of all, you got to want it, okay? Charles wants it for you. He wants it for the company. He wants it. Second thing you got to do is follow it up with somebody that can help you, okay? I am known as the master of the 21st century sales universe. This isn't what your grandfather taught you about selling. This isn't the old days. Uh, the longer you spend with somebody, the better off you are. The reality is, you know, first part is you got to decide. You have to decide how great do you want to be. And the way to decide that is really ask yourself, are you getting all there is out there? You know, I made this decision when I was 25 years old. I was like, okay, wait a minute. I'm, I'm broke. I'm getting beat up every day. I still got to go to work even though I'm broke. You know, one month's a good month. Next month's a bad month. And I'm like, what am I doing wrong? I blame the economy. I blame the, the, the product. I blame the manager. I blame the company I work for. I blame my mom. I blamed uh, the town I lived in. And then one day I was like, excuses, I can't cash excuses. These excuses are not gonna make me any money. They're not gonna pay my bills. 
And then, and then I, a guy came up to me that took interest in me and said, dude, you, you need to learn something about your trade. Just because you call yourself a salesperson, just because you have an office to go to, and just because you got a business card doesn't mean you're a salesperson. You need to learn your trade the way an engineer would or a bartender would or a pilot of a plane. I was with a guy the other day, he's a pilot. I said, what, what did it cost you? He's, he, he spent $150,000 getting his pilot license so he could fly a golf stream, uh, a private golf stream and, and, uh, and make good money. He made a $150,000 investment and thousands of hours of his time. So look, you gotta decide. You wanna be average, or you wanna be great. That's the only two choices you have. There is no middle. There's no middle ground here. You're going to be average. You're going to be great. Today's the day. Make the decision. Then all decisions must be followed up with resources, energy, time, and money. Are you following up your commitment to be great? You owe it to your kids, folks. You owe it to your community. You owe it to your church. You, you owe it to yourself to be as good as you can be. So go back and ask yourself this question. Are you getting all there is in the marketplace? If the answer is no, then it's time to grow, okay? Hey, thank you very much. My name's Grant Cardone. I'm your friend in sales and business. I'll be doing a live conference for you. Uh, we'll reschedule and I'll do something for you live, okay, to make up for this, this little mishap that we had. All right, you guys be great. Charles, thank you so much for believing in your people and the future of your family.